guys, I'm gonna be doing a reaction to Fever 333. Um, I actually did a reaction to another song of theirs that got blocked for some reason. I don't know why. Hopefully, this one doesn't get blocked again. Obviously, if you guys are seeing it, it didn't. Uh, I'm not editing these videos, I'm not monetizing, I'm not making money off of them. Uh, I do get a lot of copyright claims, but I, they leave it on my video and they get the money off of it. But, I don't mind that. I'm here for the reactions and commentary. So this one is called Made in America. Let's get into it, guys. I feel like they're gonna drop some knowledge in this fucking video. That's creepy. Another black and white video. I'm, I'm so sick of black and white videos. I really don't like them. Let's stop right there. Okay, so let me rate the song before I give my commentary out of 10. I'm gonna give it 8.5 to a 9. Fucking banger, man. I mean, wow. This song way better than the first one I heard. The first one was pretty good. This one was a fucking banger. I mean, 
I don't know much about this band. I don't even know what three 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 is uh, in the name for. I know it means something. Let me, you guys let me know what this the name of this band means. Also, you guys might be like, duh, but uh, the lead singer sounds like the lead singer from Rage. Not, he sounds dead on and if he is, well, sorry, I don't really know his name. Uh, I did listen to Rage Against the Machine back in the days, but uh, not so much today. I was a YouTube fan, but I was really into Rage Against, Rage Against the Machine. He sounds just like this guy, and I don't follow this band like that. And I haven't checked up their band members, but if it's him, then uh, let me know. Let me know down below. Um, why didn't he just they were ready to get the machine and uh, bought that band back. Uh, why didn't he start a new band? Yeah, that's him. And I uh, love the message, the lyrics, it's all true, man. It's like, there's a lot, a lot of knowledge being thrown out of this song. His rapping was on point. I mean, his rapping was more meaningful than rappers of today. The rappers of today ain't saying shit like this. There's exceptions to the rules, like Daylight, I just heard his freestyle. He, to me, that was like the greatest freestyle of this whole decade that I've heard. It has to be, maybe maybe in the top top three, there's a couple of Eminem ones that I heard. Uh, also, uh, the dude from The Roots, I thought I his name. There's a bunch of good ones, but they're not getting put on like that. Seeing rock bands that have artists, singers that can rap like this, hip hop, you should be ashamed of your fucking self. This is so sad. And man, he was, and it was hard. This was hard rock. Right? I mean, right here for me. This is hard rock. This is what I wanted. This is what I need. I'm gonna definitely look up more of Fever DB3 music. If they have an album, I'm gonna go get it. I'm gonna go cop it. Um, yeah, man, my respect. I'm, I'm pretty sure if I listen to this song even more, it's gonna be higher than what I gave it. Yeah. Let's just, you know what? For now, let's do that at 8.5, but I'm pretty sure it will be a 9. Let me know what you guys think. Um, should rappers today be ashamed that rockers are rapping better than them? I mean, damn, they should be in my opinion. And uh, let me know down below about the name. And delete it. Love, comment, share, subscribe. Peace.